Of more than 400 widows in Ifako Ijoi community have received free health insurance packages at a three-day medical outreach. The initiative included comprehensive medical checkup for indigents in the community. The medical outreach is an initiative of the lawmaker representing the people in the state parliament. Abim Bola Agbebi reports. You know, they don't want Ilosai's one, Ilosai's P2. These are beneficiaries of the first phase of Demita Kladiwale's medical outreach, a program that had in attendance the State Commission for Health. To support the good works. The burden of illness and health costs seem to be increasing globally as a result of poor access to quality health care. The lawmaker hopes to bridge this gap through the introduction of a health insurance scheme for the elderly and widows in his community. It is the maiden edition and we intend that before we complete our first tenure in office, we would have 1,000 people enrolled with free insurance health scheme in the Fakwajai. The three-day exercise also featured free comprehensive medical checkup for more than 400 indigents in the community, as well as distribution of eyeglasses. Most of our widows can really take care of themselves, and uh, he has carefully picked the vulnerable who will actually who doesn't really have the capacity to do some of these things themselves. So, for me, it's a great one for our constituents. In hospitals, even a tablet, last one like this, before getting it, Papa, it's, it's, it's stressful. I just give thanks to Almighty God and to Mr. Uh, Honorable Temitokwe. I'm really impressed. It has never happened in the history of my Ifako Ijayi for free medical tests and everything. While commendations pouring for the lawmaker for the gestures shown, concerns were raised on the poor state of the primary health centers in Ifako Ijayi community, an issue the State Commissioner for Health has vowed to address. It's not just Ifako Jaye. This is a problem across the state. We will. We have already done an assessment of all the PHCs in Lagos. Your three PHCs are on our list. We will airmark them for refurbishment. So that is what we have in store. We have got the request from um, the Honourable, and we're going to make sure that uh, we airmark this uh, local government for future development in the medical area. This is the reason why we know. At times, at these times, we we are prone to different kind of illness, and um, and the cost for these hospitals are extremely high. So we then decided that we will continue to give out the the insurance scheme for this can help cut down cost. So far, more than 400 indigents have benefited from the initiative. Adewale assured the community of more of such interventions in coming days. Abimbola Agibi, TVC News. Legos.